Yo guys, what is going on? Reginald Smithers here, and I am here again with my trusted sidekick, Squirrel Hunter. How you guys doing? So today, we're going to do a little bit of a tutorial kind of deal. You know, your last last session was more of just of a test run to see how things would go. And uh, today, we're just going to kind of focus on maybe teaching you guys a few things, telling us how we, telling you how we play Minecraft, just all those sorts of good. So, um, Connor, tell them, tell them what we're going to be doing today. So guys, today we're going to be showing you guys about mainly what kind of structures we're going to be building, teaching you about, tutorials about how to live in survival world alone while building structures to keep yourself away from zombies and other sorts of creatures and yeah, you survive around your map and you can just, yeah, so. So as you can see going. guys, I am hungry, very hungry, you can see down the little, little bomb right there. So, what we're gonna do. Oh my god, there he is again. The return of the creeper. Once again, guys, this is. Oh, gonna, sweet Jesus. This um, tutorial here is gonna take a long time, but it's gonna get. It's gonna take a lot of time to get used to, like, getting into the process of uh, getting lots of building blocks and such in order to create such type of structures. And as farther you go into the game, yeah, like the bigger and more sophisticated the structures will be and protect you more and you'll get more interested in playing Minecraft. So you guys right now we're just gonna make a little craft here. Um this or just, just I mean a little chest. Um just we can store all our stuff in here. Boom. So right now we're just gonna place plop this down, store away all our goods. Actually, take these knees. I don't need those. Let me make some sticks. Yeah, so we're going to be some, doing some hunting and looking for animals for food. And then, as we lead on to the other episodes, we will get more into what what materials you need for structures, how to build the structures, what kind of structure is best for you, and what to do to prevent other things from building into your structures and just stuff like that you know just to make sure that you're safe and you have a good time in survival oh it's dark crap Oof. okay guys so let's actually make a door instead change the game up probably gonna be our first night out just enough so just be aware of this is your first time my this is actually my favorite kind of wood if this is your first time playing Minecraft, you're really going to want to maybe take it easy and really get used to like the environment and don't take it as fast as we are. We're just showing you the details. You might not know what we are doing at first. But we're just showing you the main the main properties of your survival in Minecraft. So we're just really showing you how... And So are you, bor are you bored of playing creative mode all this time and building... Boring structures, you know, you don't really feel like you'll accomplish things. I feel you, yeah, 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 you know. Yeah. However, everyone in survival, everyone... if you actually put in the effort to get the building blocks and then create it, then you feel like you've actually accomplished something and it actually helps you, like, feel better about yourself. You absolutely, know? absolutely. It's exactly how I feel. Uh, I mean, you also have to give people the props for building those amazing builds in creative mode, you know. All those amazing, like, giant... I've seen, I've seen, like, giant Pikachus, giant, like, just dragons and stuff, and pirate ships. All those stuff is just absolutely incredible. But, and I think it's cool and all. I think it brings out the creative side. But for me, personally, I'm more of, like, the... I'm more into the survival kind of aspect, you know? Like, you're fending for yourself. I mean, look at us. We're almost dead. We're starving to death, and we don't know what to do. <sighs> yeah, so really, it gives you all the suspense, and... Yeah, really, the suspense of being in survival mode and having to survive alone. Although this game, it still really gives you a lot of stress to some people that are really into the game. Just like me, like, I can't find any squirrels here first, and I got really angry. Squirrels, Connor. Yeah, squirrels. We're going back to the squirrels already? Yeah, yeah. I'm all about them squirrels. Yeah. So I think we're just going to camp out here for tonight and uh, just kind of, I don't know, just kind of chill, I guess. Uh, 
So yeah, we'll 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 get back to you guys when it's morning. And until then, just stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, so it is not daytime, as you can see, but we are starving. So we're doing the one rule. We're breaking our one rule. We're going out at night with no armor, no nothing, no anything. Zombie already on the loose. There's creeper over there. I'm not actually like liking this idea. We're gonna go out. We have to look for some food. We're in desperate need of it. Guys, we're taking the next level, and we're really trying to survive at all costs. It's actually, the sun is rising, so it's actually alright. Sun is rising, kill me. We try to survive really as long as we can. Uh, you know what? Let's uh go right over here and just kind of. I'm just gonna show you my inventory. I'm completely empty. I stored everything away. I uh, made this iron pickaxe. I don't know if you saw it already. I made a sword also. Uh, for hunting and whatnot, and uh, yeah, we're just gonna kind of go off and explore some food for, for some food. And desperately oh, God. don't want that guy. Oh, guys. Oh, Get God. back, shit. So, later, later in the episode, you're really gonna need to find a bow. We're gonna really need to find a bow and get a bow so that we can use your bow towards the other enemies. Because, like, if you don't know already, like, the, the skeletons in this. In this Minecraft world, really have those two. So yeah, for all what well, let me just say this for all you beginners out there who've never played Minecraft before but want to start, here's the best way to kill. Okay, it's a little run, jump, hit. See that? One shot kill. As you can see, there's like little stars that pop up behind them, and that makes like a critical hit kind of kind of a way. I guess with the stone sword, one shot kill works too. Um, as you can see, you'll see like little green orbs are kind of like falling on me. Look at that gem! Little rock formation up there. Well, it looks like later on episodes, I'm gonna have to go explore that world. Is that maybe a floating island too? I'm gonna have, gonna well, have to teach you guys how to make. Well, we're like bring up this top, and I'm gonna have to teach you how to guys how to make underwater uh crafts. Like later on, once you get. To know how to survive, and I'm gonna teach you how to do like that's a floating island right there. Oh, and I am shit. starving to death. We gotta go, sweet Jesus. So, uh, like I was saying, we're gonna build structures that there's a cave right to there to survive better and you can have a better experience towards surviving like a pro. Yep, so right now we're just rushing back as fast as we can because we're starving. So yeah, three algae's underwater tunnels, uh, over at cliff hangers. Oh, look at this guy. There's a skeleton, like I told you, with is the that, ghost. Is that creeper? Oh god, oh shit. Well, you really can hurt your health, and we really need food. Because if we die now, guys, our lives are over. We're finished. And you just go around here and write with some energy, guys, we know it. Go be obliterated. And we're probably gonna drop all the way down. Now you guys are probably wondering for all the beginners out there at least. There's a pig! Why why not pig? Pig. Why not just eat the why do not just eat the raw meat? Well, I would love to do that, but you can get a little thing called salmonella. Which is not what we want, which is not what we're into. What, what's wrong with that? Now you're gonna see me making some mistakes because I am playing on a laptop and I'm using the trackpad as the my movement, not a mouse. Everything's a little different. Everything's a little more complicated, you know. But you know, it makes things more fun. Sweet Jesus! So yeah, guys, you guys don't know how to eat food. Just hold down your. It'll be your right-click button. But for me, it's my Q button. Ah, delicious chicken. Hello, Chase. Yeah, regular smitters. We really have to discuss that floating island. We really have to try to get up there. I don't that know is right. How. We did see a floating island out there. However, it is possible. For example, we can get lots of dirt and build a pathway, a stairway up to that island. And I will show you personally what to do and how to be a master at. I'm more of expertise at structures and more like the creative creativity oh my of. God. Of your Minecraft survival world, Chase is more of the survival world off of just straight up meat and straight up stones. So if you're looking for that, just keep watching these videos and we'll tell you. 
Another thing, guys, uh, you know what? Eggs aren't really a good, really proper use for us right now, but one thing that we can do that's really fun is this. Well, usually a chicken pops up, but anyway, you get the idea. That's what we're going to do. Uh, let's see here, so we're just going to... If you guys didn't know already, we, as you go better and better in your game, like, uh, like we'll show you in these episodes, is you'll eventually be able to find diamond, gold, and other sources of resources. So, for example, let's say I find diamond, you can take that diamond and build armor, and you can build more weaponry to kill animals and survive better from armor. So, hey guys, here's, here's, sorry, squirrel hunter, I just got another for a second. It's okay. So, here's the ingots that we made from the iron that we found. This is iron. These are iron ingots, and these are used to craft just the same stuff, you know, pickaxes, swords, armor, even, so on and so forth. Uh, but right now, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to, I'm going to need some wood, so let's go, let's get our, let's get our pickaxe, and let's go. You guys, like I was saying, uh, if you get... Better. Oh, oh no! Jesus. Sweet Jesus! Just to let you know from experience, Look at that. if you ever oh my God. get stuck in fire or lava, make yourself to as water as fast as possible. Uh, as you can see, we're still losing life. One thing, one thing you guys probably didn't notice is this cooked pork chop. That means a pig got stuck in that lava. Ha! <laughs> Stupid pig. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> However, guys, like I said for a short time, um, if you get more diamond, you can explore the deeper grounds, and which means you can get more diamond, and you'll get more experience with the game. You'll get better diamond, you'll get diamond helmet, you'll get all diamond armor. And this is just an example of diamond, which will really create an easier way for survival, and will really make an impact on you and your survival life. And if you stick with the same world, I'm telling you, you can be as creative as you can and make this world as crazy and creative blah, as possible. Blah, blah. And you just sit there, it's really risky. That so was I very suggest, dangerous of me. I'm as a, very a beginner, dangerous. you shall not do that because if, you, if you're falling to the game and you die, it's really risky. However, as you will not lose all your stuff, it is just very hard to retrieve. Or you drop all of it. Let's just get a good look at the atmosphere we got here. Absolutely stunning. You know, we're kind of in like a mixed biome area. We got like plains right here. Cows, we'll find cows here. We got like a little spruce forest all around here. And when we get here, it's like a desert. It's like it's all sandy beaches. You know what? I saw this thing here. You know what? You were, I'm really interested in that floating. Island. Oh, what is this in here? I thought that was. Looks like a creeper must have been in here. But you know what? Look at this. There's something over here. Looks like a cave or something. I don't even know. So yeah, guys, you'll come around. Or you'll come across like these cave, cavern-looking things. Ooh. Look at this little guy. It's kind of cool. This little canyon, little area. You know? So you can really just explore and it's just have fun very with it. Just be. Game. Just be creative with yourself and just have fun, most importantly, but you be safe as you're being in survival. So that you don't lose your materials and get a great game. So, so guys, before we take off for tonight, I just want to tell you guys exactly what I did over here. So this, this is just a little bit of like a little camp out cave I made, you know, got like little steps down here to the coal mine. Uh, this is just something I always like to start out the game with because, you know, it's pretty, you can just build from carving, you know, there's no stacking wall, there's no need for extreme resources or anything, and it's just good, good at being here because there's all these resources, all these, like, all the stone, and there's iron down below, and coal, and, and gold, and diamond, possibly, as you get lower. Uh, diamond is definitely a later episode kind of deal, but uh, right now it's just kind of another little, another little survival day. Bust almost starving to death and just kind of getting like a whole, whole sense of our surroundings. We're kind of plopped in the middle of all these little biomes. Kind of like it. And we got that floating rock over there. So I think next episode what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at that floating rock and maybe 
Scroll that. Maybe build like a little cottage out there or something like that. Maybe build like a little home or something. We'll so, just, we would really we'll appreciate you guys if you subscribe and watch all our videos and just learn from us. Although we aren't really, we're just learning right now just to get the main idea of Minecraft and we're just showing you how to be survivalist and be creative as you can with survival and have fun. Yep, we're gonna have you as guys as much as possible. We're just, we just want you guys to be creative, have a good time, and just just have you guys talk to us and be with us and enjoy the experience with us of playing some Minecraft. So, uh, regular Smarter and Squirrel Hunter. We'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for thanks for watching. Yeah, guys, thanks for joining us on Minecraft Cruise, and we'll see you next time on episode two, the building of the cottage or something. I don't know. We'll think of something. Look at this guy. Whoa, he's Who's this guy? Alright, guys. We'll see you later. See you guys. Thanks for joining us.